Community College or Turio College is an institution that provides fodder and higher education. Over one third of college undergraduate students are made up of community college students. But does it provide an education that students need? To get the answers to those questions, we spoke to some of the students from around the world who attend Santa Monica College on their experience on the quality of their education and why they chose to attend community college in the first place. Hi, my name is Rose. I'm majoring in film. Hello, my name is Maria. I'm still undecided. My name is Antoine. I'm majoring in engineering. My name is Daniel. I'm majoring in business management. My name is Julia. Computer yeah. science. My name is Michaela Goldsmith. I'm majoring in economics or business economics. And of course, we wanted to hear from the professors too. Hi, my name is Nadine Wright. I teach English at Santa Monica College. I have been a professor there in the English department for the last 17 years. My name is Kristen Louis Martinez, and I am a math professor. I took an unconventional route out of high school. I took the California high school proficiency exam. So I graduated when I was 15, and then I decided to go to community college so that I can transfer into a four year. I'm trying to transfer. I didn't get immediately into the UCLA, which is the university that I want to get into. So I'm trying to transfer next year to a UC, but preferably UCLA. I'm an international student. So for us, if we're trying to get to four-year universities, certainly if they're from the UC or you know any public Californian system, there are strict limits on the applicants they can take from out of state for public schools. So it's really, really competitive, but that doesn't exist for transfers. Pandemic happened in the middle of my senior year of high school. It sort of threw off my whole plan of going to a four year. But in the middle of the pandemic, I also did some research and saw that going to a community college for the first two years and then transferring is a lot cheaper and a lot less stressful than going straight on into a four year college. I decided to teach at a community college because I actually attended Santa Monica College as a student myself. This was my playground in my growing up years, and I wanted to give back to the community from where I came. Right before I started at Santa Monica College, I taught at Loyola Marymount University for one year. At a community college, the focus is more on the teaching rather than research. Students are like generally the same, I feel, but for community college, I always felt that I was able to connect with students a bit more. And I also felt that I was making a difference with students because there's bigger goals for, for students at community college. You're aiming to get into a four-year university. You're aiming to better your lives. And it's so enriching for me to help students on that journey. So everyone claims that community college is great, but can it compare to a private university or a state school? I think the education that they're offering in community college is good. It's a lot less stressful than going head-on to a four-year college. I have some friends who went straight to a four-year college and they say, oh, it's so stressful. I mean, I can't really compare it to anything because it's my first college experience, even education experience in the U.S. But to be honest, I think it's pretty good. I do think that it's better than university. First of all, just because of the money which you pay for university. I think the community college is a place where you can find something to study. I mean, when you go to university, you just say no, you just choose a major and study. But in community college, you can study for two years and you can choose whichever major you want. So these are factors. We do have very well-prepared students that we hear from from transfer institutions that they are right on par with other students who started as freshmen in a four-year university. I think it's honestly very good. I think the quality of it is good and the pace isn't too intense. So we still have enough time to absorb in the information and everything that we learn. One thing for sure is it's a lot cheaper than going straight to a four-year university because I can take all of my GED classes in community college for the first two years for free. 
from what they offer here in California or the LA Promise thing, then I can just transfer to my school of choice and just pay for the classes that I'm studying for instead of paying for the classes that I can get for free here in a community college. Counselors, good education. We have enough classes to take. There's like a wide variety, a lot of different choices to choose from. I think that the degree of difficulty of the courses might be easier than it is at four-year universities, but I couldn't tell you exactly because I've never been to a four-year. But it definitely misses the certain aspects of like the traditional university because everybody's really distant. So not really there to make friends. You're just there to kind of get what you need to get done. And that's definitely something that's different. I take an editing class. My teacher actually makes professional commercials so I think that's really cool he's worked on a movie as well I think that's really cool to have a teacher who's a real professional who really does well in the editing realm as a teacher here we have some of the most interesting and qualified professors on any community college campus so the college does a terrific job of including those instructors who are experts in our fields and providing the students uh, with almost every tool that would enable them to either successfully enter a course, finish maybe a certificate pathway, or maybe even an AA or two-year degree, and then maybe an option to transfer. So in addition to the course offerings, we have such a great variety of on-campus support services for our students. And so we can compete on a level with almost any university in the United States. I think we do a great job at providing students with the four-year experience and education and rigor that students would have at a four-year university, just at a community college price. At least that's what I try and do in my classes. Most of the students are transferring to prominent universities later. UC Santa Barbara. UCLA. One of the UCs, hopefully UCLA, UC Berkeley. Some UC, maybe UC Irvine. USC or Columbia or UCLA or NYU. I did some research in the film area. And those are some of the good schools that have an amazing film program. But others have a different plan. I'm not opposed to university, but I'm not exactly aiming towards it. Honestly, I'm not completely sure where I want to transfer to after this. I'm not opposed to transferring to another college, like a university or some sort, if my major requires it. But I'm also looking to just be done with community college and maybe branch out and do my own thing and find out ways to make a career for myself outside of going to college. I think students are reaching their goals, but I know that there's some students who aren't able to. And I think that as with everything, there's always room for improvement. And the more students we can help with their goals, the better. I also know that there's some students whose goal is not to transfer. Going to Santa Monica as a student gave me a great foundation. Ended up transferring to Loyola Marymount University, which is very rigorous, and I was uh, very well prepared for all of the upper division coursework. Nevertheless, some people still tend to lock down community colleges. I think they're wrong. At first, I was like that in the middle of high school. I was like that, but I was completely wrong. I am enjoying my years in community college. I don't think that community college is any less of a good education system than actual universities, at least not Santa Monica College. It's just really more of that elitist attitude to look down upon an institution like Santa Monica. I think despite the reputation that community colleges uphold, that the education isn't as good as a university or any other college, I actually do like the education offered at my school. So should you go to a community college? I would recommend going to a community college. Yeah. Yeah. I would. I mean, depending on the person. I don't think it's for everyone, but it's definitely for some people.
I would recommend them for people who are undecided, for people who are trying to save money. So I would recommend community college, yes. Not anymore. You can just get an online degree now. It's going to be like more easier for everybody. I mean, the community college was the easiest way, but now I think just online courses are really good. It just depends on the person, because if you slack off one semester at community college, there's no forgiving it. There's no like coming back from that. I mean, I would recommend it if the person was driven. So I I guess, yeah, I, I would recommend it. I definitely would recommend community college because it gets students the opportunity to explore course content areas that maybe they're unsure of which area they wanted to major in. This is a much cheaper alternative to university pricing. Community college might or might not be right for you, but make no mistake, the right community college, like the featured one here, is a quality education. So when you're considering where to go to continue your education, community college could be a great stepping stone to launch you towards your dreams.